friends here i want to discuss two important questions from physics which is useful for your improvement exams thermodynamics topics liaqs 8 marks questions concentrate and practice right the first question observe the first one explain reversible and irreversible process describe the working of carnot engine obtain an expression for the efficiency just uh, in ip manner that is exam as per exam pattern just i want to explain this question it's a very brief ex explanation just i want to discuss very important points which you have to write in your answer sheet observe clearly the reversible process and uh, one example so after that write what is a reversible process and give one example and write the definition of carnot engine a reversible heat engine operating between two different temperatures is called carnot engine right you have to describe these two definitions and uh, describe uh, about carnot engine after that very important you have to explain the carnot circle right so draw this diagram perfectly so here you have to observe uh, from this carnot cycle this a b c d the area under this cycle gives uh, work done so here you have to write about the four steps the first one is ab a to b it is isothermal expansion the second one b to c that is adiabatic expansion the third one is isothermal compression that is from c to d next one d to a adiabatic compression so if you observe the formula or equations of these two isothermal expans expansion and isothermal compression looks alike these two are in form of logarithms right so adiabatic expansion and adiabatic compression in the form of capital r into t1 minus t2 by gamma minus 1 right so while adding these four steps you get the work done here so automatically the two adiabatic expansions gets cancelled adiabatic expansion and adiabatic compression gets cancelled the complete uh, the work efficiency equation depends on isothermal expansion and isothermal compression right so this is the observation just write few important points first one isothermal expansion right that is from a to b so already told this is in the form of log w1 is equal r t1 log b2 by v1 similarly cd also you get in terms of log right the ab and cd finally involves in the equation and bc and da gets cancelled right this is the important observation here now observe the second one adiabatic expansion so in adiabatic expansion what is work done r of t1 minus t2 by gamma minus 1 where gamma is the ratio of stress to heat the next one isothermal compression yes and i told you so this is also in the form of law right so one and three equations involved here the next the d2a observe here yes right observe the second and fourth equation so both are same this is r of t1 minus t2 by gamma minus 1 minus r of t1 minus t2 by gamma minus 1 so to get the resultant work done here you have to add all these so similarly here 2 and 4 gets cancelled right so observe the difference here now in adiabatic expansion from b to c so we have to take t1 v2 power gamma minus 1 equal t2 v3 power gamma minus 1 that is from b to c and from d to a t1 v1 power gamma minus 1 t2 v4 power gamma minus 1 right now here t1 by t2 is equal to if we get in terms of uh, uh, the ratio in terms of uh, volumes so that is gives v2 by v1 is equal to v3 by v4 right now so by using all this so we get total work done W1 plus W2 plus W3 plus W4 is equal to R of T1 minus T2. Now write the efficiency is 
work done by q1 w by q1 w by q1 is r t1 log v2 by v1 so here some mathematical application here right so solve this so automatically you get what so observe clearly here uh, r and r gets cancelled log terms gets cancelled so finally you get t1 clear observe r and r gets cancelled log terms gets cancelled finally you get t1 minus t2 by t1 so this is the required efficiency equation right so for intermediate uh, long question just write all these steps briefly you get 8 out of 8 right now observe the second question so what is the second question the state second law of thermodynamics how is heat engine different from refrigerator it's very very simplest one so i think all your perfect here just observe the statements right so that is second law of thermodynamics now what is heat engine a device which converts heat energy into work is called heat engine so here mainly have to describe about three parts the first one is source the second one is heat engine third one is a sink right so just describe and draw one diagram also so regarding this yes right so this describes heat engine it's very very important and very easiest one also the next one for refrigerator okay so this is the uh, equation of efficiency of heat engine again eta is equal to w by q1 you get 1 minus t2 by t1 right now come to the refrigerator part so write all these points clearly and try to get maximum marks in physics students all the best prepare well for your improvement exams right thank you very much keep watching max guru and subscribe this channel thank you